All right. Oh, we got our first match for the night. Are you guys officially ready to get this show started? All right. Our first match is set for one fall. And contestant is Barry Wolf. in the history of professional wrestling. So, you're right, because I left my shoes under your wife's bed. Now, let me start over. Ladies and gentlemen, from Hollywood South, the Very dramatic pause. Come off his movie debut with 
Free State of Jones. They be a little bit bigger than Corey, size-wise. Not by much, but a little bit. Weight well, does matter. Backing him up to the corner and releasing. Clean release. I'll get back and cut it with the pedestal. Here we go one more time. Colin Elbow Tyler. Boys backing up to the corner this time. Did we get a clean break? Hey, we got a clean break. Both up. Barry said he pulled his hair invisibly somehow. I'm pretty sure Barry might be exaggerating just a hair. He might have got his beard hair on it. I didn't see the back there. And Barry, of course, is always friendly with the fans as he is. Here we go, an arm finger. And a wrist block. Barry Wolf is a quite an accomplished wrestler. That was a nice reversal by Corey Hall. Constantine, not Hollis, sorry, my bad. It's in the ropes, in the ropes, make you break any hold in professional wrestling today. He's kicking off his food, he probably just slid a little bit, that's what caused all that ruckus. Now Corey's doing the moonwalk. Power Nobu tie up one more time. Take him to the headlock. Barry Wolf cranking down on the headlock. There we go. Reverse him to the arm ring. Back to the wrist lock. And the wrist lock can make you tap if you like to have your wrist. And if you like to have his wrist. Back into the road. Here we go, sir. Reversal. Corey over the top. He's a little bit quicker than Barry. Just a hand. I think Barry's getting a bit frustrated. Frustration can lead to. Frustration can lead to a loss if he's not careful. Marty's getting a little bit frustrated on the outside too. The fans are getting behind for Constantine here. The Hideaway Club down here in Jackson, Mississippi. Duck the clothesline. Single leg neck down. Stop the hip. Just one for two count. Barry Bell to the outside. Monty comes to the outside. I think Corey's a little bit quicker than they expected. And got him a bit frustrated here on the outside of the room. Barry is quite scary. He's a little unstable. You gotta be careful with him sometimes. Here at Pro Wrestling Ego, we have a couple of unstable people. But Barry here. Thank you, sir. Team 504 up from Louisiana and the free state of Jones. Corey Hollis is now exiting outside, going to get a chase. Sometimes that's not the brightest thing you can do. Because you get caught coming out of the bottom of the road with a couple of That's why you don't do that. You get a beat to the score. And lead to the back. On the bird. Well, that's not a pin, that's a choke. That's a blatant choke. But he has to the kind of fire to give a blatant choke as long as he wants. Barry Wolf now has an elbow, a knee to the back, and a chin lock. Carl's trying to get behind Corey Constantine. Might have it a little bit of a combat, but he ripped his eyes. So a little bit cheap, just a little. Now we see now uh, he didn't get him the high look maneuver with his knee. I don't think it worked quite well. 
Now oh, mommy's gonna get in my fish too. Oh, nice white. To the temple. Mommy's not beyond bending the rules just a hair. We'll see him in action later on tonight. A good right shot and a head push. Scary Barry Wolf. Now he's giving him. Well, that's just a big to the throat. Nice flexibility shown by Barry Wolf there. Get a snap there. And a pin. I don't know why you would pin somebody on a snap there, but Barry, like I said, he's a little off. Boy's coming back. Inside blows. Here we go. Let's see what he's got. And he's got a fish. That's what he got. He went for the double knees. It didn't quite work out for him. a nice suplex by Barry Wolf. He said, can you feel it? Can you feel the scary of Barry Wolf? Carry him to the corner. Shoulders to the midsection. Two shoulders. And three shoulders. And now, Blake, we shake one more time by Barry Wolf. And a head bit. And Marty's going to give him assistance one more time. Yeah. I ain't going to say they cheat, but I ain't going to say they play fair either. They say if the ref didn't see it, it didn't happen. This one's poorly, he might have come back. Lead to the gut. Hit to the gut. What the hell is this? This looks like. Yeah, that didn't work out for Ford. You know. Look at an assisted leg super. They're like Taz from back in ECW days right there. I'm not sure what Corey was going for, but it did not work for his advantage. And there he is tearing up these headbutts tonight. Technically, there's nothing against headbutts in wrestling, so, hey, it's clean. Well, I speak for clean, and then he stands on his plate. So, uh, you yeah, know, he has to fight. We're a pro wrestling ego. We don't encourage cheating, but, you yeah, know, if you can get by with it, go for it. Nice punch to the throat. Sends him off for him, reverses him, he's coming in. Takes his a big boot. Let's see what we got here. Tornado Suplex. Says a C.W. Anderson. And he says he's from the 504. He plays with Tim Brown. It's still just a two count. He likes choking him. He, he really needs some trachea help tonight. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Now, I believe in a face lock, from my point of view, it's kind of a little hard to tell, but that's what it looks like. Yeah, that's what it was. Into an arm injury. Into a knee to the face. And there he goes down. Fall. Paul's getting behind Corey. We're going to see if that's going to do any good. Both men are going down and we're on a double four count. Slowly both men are right. Like a bad name. They're getting up. Ooh, a forearm by Corey. Oh, open hand slap by Bear. A forearm by Corey. An open hand slap by Corey. A forearm 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 by Corey
Pour on by Corey. Got a little bit more room for me. Corey got an open hand slap one more time. Barry, one more time. And duck the clothesline. Kick to the rear. Drop it. He still hasn't taken Barry off his feet yet. And he's got a four buster. Suplex, whatever you like to call it. And a knee to the chin. A two, he did a one. He did a two. He's in the ropes. Like I said, the ropes can break anything. Any hold, anything. The ropes can be your best friend. Or your worst enemy. I think Barry might have a chance. And then he got a spin kick to the head. Barry drops the chain. Graf grabs it. Mama grabs Corey. Barry comes up behind Corey and grabs him by the testicles. For the school board. I think it's the winner. Testicular school board. Barry Wolf wins.